Welcome to the channel, everybody. My name is Ryan, and this is Dot Age, and we are back with our Shaman playthrough. This is episode number three. If you are just tuning in for the very first time, there is a link to the full playlist down below in the description. So if you'd like to start fresh from the beginning, there's that for you. But we are currently looking at all four domains. This is the very first page, too. So we're still on page one here, very early. And we've got an event coming up here shortly. We've got the seasonal change and then the big armageddon event is, or the doom event is here in the temperature domain so we've got to get on top of some of these you can see we're actually producing sickness points from an injury we've got but it's not the end of the world because there is no injury or i should say sickness event there might be they can pop up though so we got to watch that now we've got ourselves a fear event tonight but we should be good hopefully and we've got some research to choose too so been thinking about it now we did the clearing the warehouse let's go to totem so what do we need to upgrade i think our research might be smart to start thinking about an upgrade for so let's get that knocked out real quick very good very good and let's see did i place one of the little we just researched it i remember what it's called the refreshments i'd like to get one of those laid down it's hard to remember i've mentioned this before in my previous playthrough but i would love it if the developer would add something specific like this is a good example the wood pile i already have one wood pile built it's right here I think it would be so helpful if they just in included like a number right here. So if, if you've got one built, it says one there. If you got two wood piles spread out, it would say two. You know what I'm saying? That way, instead of like having to search the map for like this refreshment stand, I could just go to it and be like, oh, okay, it's got one there. So I know I've got one place. You know what I'm saying? I get it though. That's a minor, minor recommendation. But nonetheless, there it is. So I don't think I have placed one of these. Let's see. Oh, I did. It's right here in front of my stupid face. Whoops, sorry. Hit escape. All right, so that's it right there. We're working on it. But um, yeah, yeah, I just wanted to make sure because this is going to be a critical building for us. It's going to produce sickness and nature points. We're okay on nature for now, but that could change. Now, in addition, let's think about the cold domain. So I need to get this placed. Okay, that's going to require hemp and surrounded by flat land oh okay so we just can't put it like next to the block uh the stones i guess but we're gonna need some hemp aren't we okay so we don't have any extra labor now do we have any kiddos growing we have one little baby and we've also got one injured pip where you at he's the one producing that stupid sickness point right there and he was like injured for 20 freaking turns there he is bravo how long bravo is that that's not him ailments oh there it is one injured pip oh it is him do i need to there it is 17 turns damn so he cannot work for 17 turns and he is producing one sickness point pretty pretty dastardly i'd like to just scrub him out off him <laughs> i can't do that though no, no, no. we're not killing any pips intentionally or unintentionally hopefully but um i think we're good we don't have any notifications telling me like we're starving or anything food is getting a little iffy though but we've got our tomatoes going so i might have to keep that going we need more but let's go all right so that's done beautiful here we go okay test our fate we should be good if i fail this i'm gonna be so pissed oh <gasps> No, Pips are panicking. Should I scold them? The village gains two fear. That's nothing. They're going for hope. Four fear. What? Oh, so it's another 50 50. Uh, I'm just going to go with this one. Yeah, we can overcome that easily. How did I? How did I lose that? So that's the first two events that we could have changed. I failed both of them. I literally failed both of them. <laughs> ah, that's what the little lightning strike is. It's a bad one. It would be a four-leaf clover, I think, if we had completed it positively. But, I mean, you saw how much of a deficit, or, like, the difference there was. I can't help that. I just got unlucky. Ugh, that's okay. What are, what are you, you going to do? So, we've got some seeds built up. Now, I need to change these boys over to hemp. 
All right. Yep. Get to work. Whoever that was, get to work. Yep. Confirm. Okay. So I don't have the pip for that. That's okay. Let's see. Man, we are barely just staying ahead of this food, aren't we? Now, the water pip, she's producing this and that. I'm going to pull her, put her there. We don't need a lot of this hemp. I just want to like a turn or two so we can have a little stockpile of it. And then I can build that other building. So this is going to pop up in a couple. Oh, the baby grew up. Let me see here. I need two pips that we can reproduce. Honestly, you know what? No, because I'm pretty close on my food right now. I'd like to throw down some more labor, but this boy right here really screwed me. I just don't know about this. I already feel like we're off to a terrible start. <laughs> oh, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? You just got to play through. That's the thing with this games like this, especially which have like the memories, the roguelike elements to them. You just play through it. Even if you're not feeling great, who knows? You might turn things around and ultimately we'll still unlock a bunch of stuff. Where are we? Oh, I've already unlocked all those. I don't know what I'm doing. There we go. This is where we're at. Captain. Okay. Just get it moved into position because we're going to unlock it today, hopefully. Let's see. Come on now. There it is. Tall totem. Okay, good. And we're, we are building a little surplus of food. It's just very slow. Now, we've got our tall totem. Physician's table, no. What does this require? I feel like I need the healer's hut. That we probably need two. Two of hemp requires dwelling within one. What am I missing? Oh, stone. Okay, yeah, we should probably think about stone. This requires leather. God, shaman is so needy. No, but the uh, stone's a pretty basic thing. I think we can at least research it right away. There it is, 12 turns, dang. All right, hold on, we're not researching that right away. No, no, we'll go for something a little bit easier. We'll do... Fruit infuser. I feel like all this stuff is so necessary trying to get ahead of the game, you know, but choices, choices. Now, this guy, what does this produce, though? It just holds rabbits? Wait, it doesn't produce, like, leather, leather or anything like that? I don't know. Because with the shaman, I think we're going for, like, a vegetarian run, but I don't know if this is even worth it. I guess it is to unlock the stuff down the road, but damn. All right, I'm going to try the fishing post. And because I don't know if that counts as killing an animal. It does say hunting. Because unfortunately with the shaman, whenever we, we kill an animal, we gain fear points from that. So we're not going to be able to rely on meat very much, which shouldn't really be a factor because there's so many different options for food especially like vegetarian food it's just I mean, early on it is a little bit tougher but um i think we're good i don't know feel like that might be a waste damn 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 all right let's just go for something like this all right let's do the orange tree seasonal summer yeah yeah we'll get ready for the summer with those because we've only got four days till summer that's better that's a better choice i hope we'll find out this game, man, things snowball so quickly. All right. And now can we upgrade here, though? Yeah, just wood. Oh, we can do that. Put our uh, little research on hold for a turn or two. That'll take, oh, just one turn. Beautiful. Nice. That's going to be super helpful. All right. So our other pip finished his berries. We need to replant this. Thank you very much. I think we can pull our hemp guys. So we got a bunch of extra labor. Let's go ahead and plant some more tomatoes. Water maker. Mm. I really do want to put these next to them. For one thing, I, is this going to hurt? Okay, I just scattered the creatures, which that's fine. I don't care about the creatures because we're probably not going to use too many of them anyway. Plus there's rabbits everywhere. I don't think it produced any fear points. Or maybe it did. Is that where those? No, no, no. All right, so we're fine. Um, should we reproduce? Here's the thing. It does take like five, four turns for the baby to grow up. So we'll do that. We'll use our two pips to produce a baby. And I think we're good. Food's fine. We don't have any notifications down here. Three days. Let's go. 
Oh, what was that building? I wanted a place that cost hemp. It was... Yep, the fan. We're going to need these for summer for sure. So what does it say? Wind event surrounded by flat. Oh, okay. Um, I don't know what the best place to put this is. Maybe over here next to our hope. No, let's, let's put it over here. It seems like there's more room here. Very good. Okay, now I probably will need a couple of these. So I'm going to, again, try and get ahead of the game here. Place a couple next to each other. We don't have to man them. You know, we just need to have them. And let's see. Okay, so that's buried. We got tomatoes. I think I'm going to get some more tomatoes planted. I feel like that's going to be pretty important. Um... Yeah, I don't love that because it's so close to the bivouac. And I know that there were a lot of buildings that kind of need to be close to this, but it's just a field. So at some point in the off season or something, I can move it, just delete it and put something else there. But for right now, the extra tomatoes it's going to get from procking next to that water is pretty important. Three pips available for work. Wow, it's crazy having so many pips available, even when one of them's injured. Well, I tell you what, let's see. Put a couple of them in our hope uh, producers. That way we can maybe balance this out. And again, I know this is scary. The fact that like my sickness domain is counting up. Honestly, I probably should try and deal with that. So we'll put him there. Yeah, it's not good because eventually these points are going to stay there even till the next, even into the next prophecy page. So if I get a, let it get too far out of hand, then the next event that does happen, we're going to be screwed. And we might already be there. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. All right, let's go. Okay. Tomatoes are finished down here. Ooh, food is not looking good, is it? Can I plant? Yeah. Okay, we got one pip available. Oh, these guys are producing here. We don't need them there. But hold on. I want to see these. Look how spinny they are. Very spinny. All right, what are we doing? Let's see. Can I place another dwelling? I need one more leather. That's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Okay. So we need food though. Desperately. Some pips require food. I have to do it. I have to break into our stash of berries. That's not going to be good either. Cause we don't have a lot of stuff to replace it. These plums are good. You know what? I should have fertilized the dang ground under the bushes, but that's okay. Mm. Yeah, this is tough. All right. So that's growing, growing, being planted. Got the food coming here. Let's go ahead and expand down here too with the signpost. Yep. That'll help us because this produces five per turn. So that's really good. Let's see, is there any more plum trees around? We're going to get that next turn. Oh, that's really far out there. Hmm. Okay, well, no need to worry. We just need to plant another tomato field, I think. All right. Oh, I don't want to plant it over the water. No, it doesn't. Uh, you know what? Screw it. I'll just put it over here and we'll fertilize it. Not enough seeds. You jerks. That was my fault. I didn't notice the seeds, but we'll get there. We'll get there. Okay. Next turn might be a little tough here. We got to get these this food situated. Oh. <gasps> It is summertime, folks. Hello, Mr. Ms. Shaman. What do you got to say for yourself? It's summer. I knew that already. Thanks for telling me. All right, we are good. Let's see here. Okay, two hope. Yeah, this is ugly. This is real ugly. This is beautiful. Ah, look at that. We're already producing heat right away. Oh, these produce two per turn. That's good. Just use one person for that. Okay. Will you please? Oh, oh, I didn't put my druids back on my research. That's why we had so many extra pips. Oh my God. I'm such an idiot. All right. Let's see here. Where's my other druid? Well, that's okay. She can, what? Building is abandoned because the animal. Oh my God. I screwed that up. Oh, shoot. Well, we can just build another one right there. Damn, 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 damn. Oh, well, 
honestly, that water, I mean, the food is going to be so much more important. Are we okay on food? Barely. Uh, let's see. We've got him on the bushes down here. Hmm. I'm just thinking about fertilizing that bush right now. Um, we'll let him keep producing seeds. We're definitely going to need the seeds. Oh, and now we're getting low on wood. Jesus. It's all collapsing. It's all crumbing, crashing down on me. All right. Um, injured Pip, 10 more turns. Let's see here. All right. Not much to do except just push onward, onward and upward. Let's go. Damn. Already, I don't have enough labor. <clears throat> okay, let's see. All right, seed man. Got to put you over here, buddy. We do need somebody working on those seeds, but right now food's a bigger deal. Okay. Where is my berry? Oh, there he is right there. All right. Just thinking, considering... Not much to do. We will finish this off next turn, so that's going to be very helpful. I might as well go ahead and delete this now, because that rabbit is gone. You know, Even if I were to get rid of the field, I don't think the rabbits come back. So, <sighs> that was a blunder. What are you going to do? Yeah, it's not the end of the world, though. All right. Because research isn't like going to get us killed or anything. <laughs> not in an active fashion. Passively, maybe. Hey, we got some tomatoes back. Okay. Oh, we got this one up here too. I've got one pip available. Let's grab our research here. I'm going to stick with the food, maybe? Basic tools, no. The well's not a bad idea. Like water, you don't need it until you need it, you know? Ugh, this rabbit hutch. I'm just going to do the rabbit hutch. I don't know if it's really going to be helpful, but it does unlock a bunch of other stuff. So now with that extra pip, I'm going to need seeds, but I'm going to make sure he fertilizes right here. I freaking wasted a rabbit for it. So we better fertilize it, right? All right. That's good. That's all our pips, except for the pip that can't work. Ooh, sickness. That's ah, making me cringe. That sickness domain. Wait, are we sure? Some pips require food. Oh no. Oh no, we have no food now. How many do we need? Four? Okay, well you, sir, need to stay there. I can pull one of them off of that. There. And that one, come to the tree. All right, that should be good enough food for sure. Build a little surplus. Of course, our help domain is on hold now, but that's okay. Because again, I don't think there's any more active events, at least on this prophecy. And we're ahead, so. Oh, God, is... Oh, thank God it's not negative. I was going to say another negative mini event here. I don't need that. All right, we're good. They're infatuated with each other. Whatever. I don't concern myself with the romances of a pip. All right, what do we got? Till the soil, boys. Give me some maters. Who's not working where they shouldn't be? Okay, cold is good. Tomatoes, you're making me sick. Let's do, let's pull him off. No, 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 finish the berries. All right, I, th I mean, we're fine on food. I'm just making sure that everything is perfectly efficient. All right, we're good, we're good. Two more turns. One more, technically. <gasps> Not the smartest, great. These mini events, bro, they're killing me. I think that's how a person got injured. The rabbit hutch. All right, we've got it. We know the rabbit hutch. See it open up the butcher's table and the rabbit shear. Uh, so I guess we can do the rabbit shearing. Oh, and it opened up cow ranch. I wonder, does this guy produce milk? That'd be helpful. Let's not worry about that. Tent needs leather. So how the hell do I get leather? Are we literally going to have to hunt though? Hmm. I'm just a little confused. I mean, because she obviously, the shaman requires leather for her buildings, but she also takes like a, a a fear hit if we kill animals. So I would think you'd want to avoid it at all costs, but that's not going to be possible if we require leather. You know what I'm saying? I mean, we can't just wait for the animals to die of old age. That ain't going to work. So yeah, we're going to have to butcher some animals at some point. I mean, that has to happen. So I'm going to get ahead of my bonfire. It's only four turns. Let's, let's just get that knocked off. 
we'll have that done one turn. So, okay. Uh, wood, he's over there working good. Water's fine. I need more seeds. Need to plant that too. Damn, we got one dude. One little guy here. All right, sir, you work on some seedage for me. We've also got these birds too. So I am sure we can do something with those in the bu in the bushes there. Now, the rabbit hutch. Hold three rabbits. We got to feed the rabbits too, though. Remember, requires dwelling within one. All right, let me put it like right here. Oh, I could just clear the rabbits. No, I'm kidding. Um, they don't need to be near the rabbits. They need to be near the hut. So that's probably good. I'm putting it, and we're not building it, but like I said, we got to feed the rabbits. So I just want it down so I don't forget about the fact that I researched it. Oh, 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 oh. Speaking of forgetting. Yeah, this is huge. So it doesn't look like it needs to be near anything specific. I'm going to put it kind of down here. I want mo I want a bunch of those. What am I doing? I can hold shift too. Hold shift and you can just place a bunch. There we go. Uh, again, I don't think I'm going to place all of these right away. I don't have the labor for it for one thing, but let's see here. So how are we doing on food? We're looking a lot better with our tomato fields up here. Honestly, this guy should be up here right now. I mean, these kind of are our backup. And you know what? I'm going to delete that. Yeah, we don't need that one there. and Because we'll focus more on these trees down here. So she's producing the plumage. I'm tempted to pull her. And let's have her build. Is that going to kill our food? No, we're fine. We're still okay. We burned through our berries though, didn't we? It's expected. That's why I, that's why I stockpiled them for a rainy day. And it started to rain. Look at that. Refreshing rain. <laughs> okay. Let's move past that. Wait, what does that do? I didn't even look at the consequences of it. Because I cared so little. I thought it was supposed to pop up right here. Oh, here it is. Uh five percent daily chance of a pip becoming wet. Great. Uh, um, all right. What do we want? So we did the fire. Cool. Let's go down the line here. Let's see. Okay. Can't do much without a farmer there. I think we're okay on that table. Let's look at the growth tab. I should say. Yeah. You know what? I got to do this hunting tent. I have to also, I need the butcher table too, but the basic tools. Oh, that's probably another big one too. That I remember neglecting that. The first time I played and definitely need tools. So I'm going to go for that Tools, stone. Oh, there's so much, so much. We do have some decent druids though. Oh, this is pissing me off. Get that out of my face. It's my mistake glaring at me, mocking me. Okay. This actually has some berries here hidden away. Remember we can forage for these straight through the fall, but winter time they will dry up. They shrivel up. All right, let's go. We're good. Oh my gosh. It's a challenge, guys. This is just normal difficulty, too. Of course, I believe the Shaman is a bit more difficult than Mattis as a leader. She presents her own unique challenges, no doubt about it. But um, it's not an easy game, guys. I'll tell you that much. But that's what makes it good. Who wants to play an easy game? If you do, you know, there's checkers or something for you. All right, let's see. Tic-tac-toe. Um... They're actually really hard to win at tic-tac-toe. <laughs> um, getting distracted here. We got one pip available. He is a handyman. How's our sick pip? How much longer, Brapo? Four turns. It's going to be amazing. It's going to be like a revelation when Brapo's in, uh, no longer sick. I feel like... Damn. This domain is going to get me... I'm going to... Mm, we're going to be in bad shape the next event that pops up, but whatever. Now, that's, that's a waste to put him there. Let's get him on the food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Need to stockpile the old El Fudo. Okay. Oh, you know what? No, hold on. I got a better idea. Plant. Not enough seeds. Of course. Of course there's not enough seeds. Why would I think there's enough seeds? Hurry up. You and your meager seed production, sir. Now, wait a second. I thought we were producing oh we did just have our heat event that's why it reset i was gonna say i thought we had like heat coming in or something we don't so i'm gonna put him over here take that guy seeds sir get over there make me some seeds 
Now I could pull him off at this point. Yeah, now we have the seeds coming in next turn, so that'll work. I just want to get ahead of the food, you know. Plus, these things are only active during the summer, so we need them, you know. Get them planted now. We'll have a few turns left with them, and then next summer they'll be great. We'll have a whole orchard down here. It'll be great. We don't have to rely on stupid tomatoes or plums or whatever. Wild plums. That sounds gross. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, let's see here. One pip. It's always one. It's just one. Do we need to have another baby? Oh, should we have another baby? No. I'm not going to go overboard with the babies. All right. Water's mediocre. Wood's okay. Food is scaring the crap out of me, but what are you going to do? I think I'm going to start stockpiling the blueberries. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's good. I like doing that. Stockpiling. Because these are pretty limited. Where is our berry guy? He likes to jump around. He'll go from bush to bush. I don't even see him. We're getting five per turn. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. I just, I don't even see him. Okay, workbench. That's another one I need to place, even though I might not build it right away, because I'll probably forget about it. Six wood. Um, What does it need? Woodmaker within one. Well, you're, you're in luck, sir. You go right there. All right, what are we going to research next? Let's do this stone gatherer, because that's going to be a prerequisite for a lot of later buildings, no doubt about it. All right. Oh, look, the heat is back. Go figure. It faked me out. Okay, I need to put two people. Damn, where do I get two people from? Seeds? Seed guys. Seed guys. You just got voted, or volunteered, I should say. All right, let's go. What's happening? I haven't noticed any pips getting wet yet. Have you guys? Oh, yeah, we got two wet pips. I don't think it really does too much, right? Overridden by frozen. We can cure them, but I don't know what that does. Like, what does wet do? Does it like reduce their efficiency or something? I don't even know. Um, she's producing two. She's producing two. They're both wet though. Is that reduced? I don't know. Oh, well, not going to worry about it. Let's see here. Because I don't have any bonfires built either. That's probably something, again, I should set up. So consumed by water heals what tracks fire. Okay, it doesn't need to be next to anything. So let's stick it like all the way up here. I'll put a couple of these down. I'm hoping that this reminds me to build these things. Even though they're kind of up there at the top. I'm pretty sure it'll help. Oh, look, our oranges are ready. Now, I don't have any pips available, but I think I probably want to fertilize the soil, right? Or till it. Yeah, I know there's no worker available. There's our berry guy. Hey, I found you. Let's put you to good use here, son. Fertilize your tree there. Good, okay. And the wood, you know what, the wood guy, you're coming off there right now. I'm pulling you off. You know what, I'm going to fertilize this too. Might as well. Plum tree is actually probably better to fertilize because we can do those year round, right? Yeah. Oh yeah, this is going to be our orchard down here. I love the looks of that. All right, let's go. One turn, we're good. Oh my gosh, guys. Well, like I said, I'm feeling a little bit nervous. The Cygnus domain is, oh! Oh, we got a reckoning of it. Oh, so what that means is because I let it get so far ahead that there's a reckoning. Oh, I forgot all about those. Well, in a way, it's good because it will reset this. And then I can kind of get ahead of it again by starting to put somebody down. So, yeah, it's unfortunate. But, hey, we're learning, right? God, I feel like I'm off to a way worse start. <laughs> But I keep saying that nonetheless, guys, we're st I'm going to push through. I'm not giving up. I'm not restarting or anything like that. It was one lesson my dad taught me when playing chess. Even if you think you're going to lose, play it through because there's still a lot to learn in every loss. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, I appreciate you guys tuning in for the series. Hit that like button for me. Leave me some comments down below, too, if you got some tips or just some 
attaboys for me help me motivate <laughs> i really appreciate you guys anyway so i will see you all on the next episode